climbing up this glacier. We just, you know, in France, decided to uh, have a little make-out session. Yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about just getting after it. We're on a train headed to Mount Grande Bour, waiting on these other trains to pass. Headed up to Mount Blanc as well. Gonna be going through Ice Cave. There's the glacier. Look at that. Looks like dirt, but it's solid ice underneath. Got a couple of waterfalls. Y'all want to hike down the mountain? Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's roll. We're hiking. We're hiking down this mountain to an ice cave. It is spectacular. The children are doing a phenomenal job navigating down these rocks. Do you think but, the ice uh, cave's going to be cold? I do. Uh, okay. But look at that. Is that amazing or what? Here in uh, Chamonix, we took a train from Chamonix up here to Grand de Manavour, Mount Blanc. It's crazy, beautiful, breathtaking. God created all this for our enjoyment. That's the glacier right there. It's all ice down there. It's like dirt and pebbles, but it's ice. We are on top of ice. Glacier. All right, there's the ice right there. And we're about to go in this ice cave. So we just come down. I mean, huge. It was quite a journey. We had a good time. We took the natural path and then got on these stairs. Uh, come down here to the ice cave but we're gonna we're gonna go in it here we go we're going in pretty sweet look how look how cool i don't know if that was past years but we're going through the ice right now in a glacier amazing touching the ice this is so cool what do you think guys you're in a glacier Woo! this is awesome i mean we are in a glacier folks i want you to just wrap your head around that crazy never would have thought to be inside a glacier and we just found this trip like yesterday to come do it. It's pretty crazy. I'm overwhelmed. Feels good in here after that hike. It's like air conditioning. All right, we made it out safe. It was uh, quite dangerous. We heard a lot of cracking in the ice. And uh, I was wondering what it was and I looked around and Asa was throwing big, huge chunks of ice into ice go figure but we had a good time it was cool um so lots of snow on top of each other and then it formed this glacier over the years gradually falling maggie says uh, at the beginning and now it's falling faster I guess since it's getting no, lower it's altitude. It's oh. oh, faster now it's sliding down slower. Oh, so it's it sliding down faster. slower. Yeah, so it melts faster. Hoodie, you're gonna get super hot Whatever. Hoodie. It's getting in a lower altitude is why I think it melts faster. But uh, I'm no rocket scientist. <laughs> so now we're back on the journey upward. Up this glacier mountain probably take a break then maybe eat some lunch when we get on top climbing up this glacier we just you know in france decided to uh have a little make out session yeah yeah i'm talking about just getting after it right here climbing the mountain just feeling it just decided you know what seems like a, like a good time to just take a little break and I have a little make-out session. So, 
you know i mean look at the scenery why wouldn't you why wouldn't you want to do it so uh hey we're in france feeling the love feeling the love <laughs> we're coming back down the mountain on the train and there's Shamani in the valley. Look, we got one overboard. We got one overboard. We got one overboard. Woo oh man. <laughs> oh man. I think they are having a blast, man. That was awesome. Did you see them? How, what do you do? Just jump in? Yeah, they jumped in. They just wanted to see how it felt like that. Man. Don't get me away with that rock. Throw it hard. Throw it hard, Gus. Throw it hard. Far away. There you go. Nice one. Out of way. So we got about 40 minutes before we got to be at the bus station. We decided to have a little picnic right here next to the Glacier River. Pistachios and then some beautiful scenery of the mountains and then my beautiful angel wife yes and these three wonderful gifts children we had a great time headed back to Geneva but uh was that hour bus ride about an hour bus ride y'all see we see fish see some fish in that water right there crystal clear look got a duck diving down got some look, grass right there right up under the boat look at that fish yeah. there goes some i think those are tench we're getting excited we're about to get on the boat lake geneva fishing in switzerland it's wild first time ever so if the uh if the guy doesn't find them, I'm gonna say, hey, I know where I know where a few are right here by the dock. All right, y'all ready guys? Yeah. About to get after. It. All right, we're about to get on the boat. He's come to pick us up. Got the word, we're going after perch and pike. Asa and Gus, they've been chasing around the, the goose. This is our guide right here, Baltazar. Hey. Baltazar, hey. He's, he's excited. He's just as excited as I am, I love yeah. it. So we're gonna get after it. Maggie's acting like she's just gonna take pictures, but I know how it is. She always gets the biggest one. Yep, that's right. And oh, the most, I'm just gonna and set, the most. I'm just gonna sit back and take pictures. But here we go. Let's get on. Get on the boat and yes, he has the right equipment. Shimano, Stella. She's gonna catch a big pike on it, hopefully. But look. Woo! Big fountain, super clear water. See down at the bottom. I think we're in uh I don't know how deep it is right here, but super clear. Woo. Big fan. I'm going to get under the canopy here if he's going to go under because I don't want to get wet. But yeah. Woo. Huge. So Fish and perch. Here's what you have to do. So you just first place. You just check that everything is straight here. Yep. Your little, uh, the little thing here is uh, hanging and not, you know, taking anywhere here. Perfect. Under. Perfect. Swivels down below so the rod. So just going to let go. So you open your wheel, let it go. And then when it hits the bottom, you'll see that the line will stop moving, you know? Yep. Yeah. So Boom. here. Bottom. Bottom. Here. So then you close your wheel. Yep. And you just put a little bit of tension, you know? Mm -hmm. And then you And then you keep on. it. Close to the bottom, and you can start wheeling slowly and taking it back. Nice. Right. You got it, Asa? Okay. Got it? Oh, like he got one. He got, got one. one. Got one. Reel it. Yeah, Reel it, Asa. Okay, wheel. Reel it. Are there hands? Reel there? it. Reel it. Are they huge? Uh, I think it's, it's gone. It come off? No, oh, he's on there. Two of them. Two, the two little ones. Oh, All right. Look at that. So you can stop here. Look. Yay. Yay. May you take a picture of me? Son. Yes. I got it on camera, dude. <laughs> Put those on for the big pike. That's what I'm fishing in with right there. About to get the big pike. Baltazar showing me the technique over here. So, uh, yeah. 
You want to build that now? Yeah, a bit small. Less small? Yeah, too small. No, we'll, we'll turn them loose. Those, those small ones. Yes. Yes. So you let it sink to the bottom? Yeah, no, and no, no, then no, no. Just, you oh. bring it back directly. Oh, okay. Yeah, because here you're on the grass. And the grass. Just pop the grass off. So just real slow, above the grass. Touch. And directly, I slowly, I bring it back. Yep. Like this. Yep. I put it up. And when I take the line back, I keep the tension in the line. This is very important. Yes. I put it up and I keep the tension in the line when, I, when, you, line, when my, you're letting it fall. Right. And that way you can feel them hit it. Yeah. They hit it on the fall. Like what, exactly. Yep. Yep. Right. I'm on it now. I'm on it. Baltazar has got me. And so it's got the. Here it's deeper. Yes. Now we are at 7 meters, so we're going to probably move a little bit uh, deeper. Yes. Uh, so when you cast where it's deeper, you can wait a little bit, it goes out. Okay. But when you cast close to the shore, it's better to bring it back directly. I got you. And so Pike just swam by and ambush it. Yeah. All right. All right, we're on it now. We got the technique. Ace has already got a couple perch. What's he fishing with? Maggots? We're on the move, folks. We're on the move. Hold it like that. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Daddy. All right, hold it. You ready? Hold it. Nice. Got you on the GoPro. Good catch. Was it fun? Yeah. All right, turn, you turn him loose. Turn him loose. There you go. Nice. All right. Those things giant. A monster fish. Look at that. Good job, Asa! Everybody get to the other side of the boat. Ooh. Ooh. No. Baggins. Hey, uh, Asa. My turn. That's right. Gus's turn. Yeah. Lewis, Lewis knows. What, what are you putting on there? Anything or just red No, they, they think they're mosquitoes. For it. Baltazar got his big pike. Look at that. I mean, the thing, the pie, he's not as big as the lure almost, is he? Huh? Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> what do you think, Ace? Huh? Okay. Look Hold at him how up. big this nice. is. Nice. Isn't it? Yes. <laughs> We're going to release it? Turn him loose. Yeah? Turn him loose. Let's watch it. Yes. Up. Ooh, he gone. He did a little flip for us. Disoriented. He's lost. Where am I? <laughs> Joe has finally got the fishing bug. She's hooked up on a big perch. Woo! Yeah, so nice. You like that? Look at this guy, dude. Let's take a look at him. No, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, man. Hey, Captain. Hey, Captain. Oh Let me go in. Up there, okay? <laughs> Gus, Gus is ready to roll. We're not all swimming, you know? Yeah, exactly. Uh... <laughs> nice, so. There he goes. I'm ready to do it again. Yes. All right, she's ready. <laughs> Look, the other day he said he had some bites on the raft up next to the shore. But we may have to change up. We may get a little, little flash going on, something. Yep, Gus, you're next. Yep. All right, the captain, the captain is taking us to the spot. He got, he knows where the power is. This boy know where he's going. Yes, he's taking us. He knows where the big pike is. We gotta get after it. Hopefully we get, get on one right here. I got a good feeling about it. Look how beautiful though, look at the mountain range. Man, it's amazing, amazing views here. Fishing in Switzerland, it's awesome. Alabama boys, Alabama boy right here. He's on. He's in his element fishing, but whole different, whole different world over here. Whole different world. I'm hoping I get a big pipe hooked up right here. Sun's shining. 75 degrees. Perfect to be out on the water. 
a little calmer over here, so it's time to get after it. All right, now we're trolling. New plan. We're gonna troll down this bank on the way back to Geneva. Hopefully, this is gonna hook up a big pike. So. All right, sun's setting below the mountains. We're waiting, we're trolling still. And we're fighting. Waiting on the pike. It's been, uh, it's been tough evening, but beautiful. Geneva, surrounded by the mountains. You have a beautiful so, smile. About to call it a day. Go get some supper. Riding back. Beautiful ride. Beautiful sunset here in Geneva. This is awesome, man. We didn't catch a big pike. Caught a few perch, the kids did. Had a good time.